I wish I had button eyes and a red felt nose Shaggy cotton skin and just one set of clothes Your United States Navy and Naval Reserve welcome you to Navy Hoedown. With us each week in person are the top stars in the country and western scene. I'm Hal Durham, your host on this series, and our guest today is one of country music's most talented and most delightful stars, Miss Jean Shepherd. Not living nor loving, nor going nowhere. I wish I was a teddy bear. And wishing that I hadn't fallen. Monday's promise is Tuesday's lie Saturday's party is Sunday's fight Something's wrong with you and I Love's gone wrong that used to be right And I can feel it slipping away Slowly, slowly slipping away It'll be gone in a few more days we don't stop this love of ours from slipping away Wednesday's kisses or Thursday's frowns We can't live two days in a row When our world's not upside down Here we stand watching it go And I can feel it slipping away Slowly, slowly Slipping away, it'll be gone in a few more days If we don't stop this love of ours from slipping away Roses are red, violets are blue Sugar is sweet some of the time This puzzle's missing a piece or two We've got the grapes and I can feel it slipping away Slowly, slowly slipping away It'll be gone in a few more days If we don't stop this love of ours from slipping away And I can feel it slipping away Slowly, slowly slipping away It'll be gone in a few more days if we don't stop this love of ours from slipping away If we don't stop this love of ours from slipping away And that marvelous sound is from our special guest on Navy Hoedown, Miss Jean Shepherd. That was a very big song for you, Jean. Yes, it was, Hal. Welcome aboard Navy Hoedown. Thank you. Good to be with y'all. You've got some great songs to do for us, and we'll hear another one in just a moment. Jean Shepard is our guest, and she's going to sing a song that I haven't, uh, I don't think I've heard you do this It's one. brand new, Hot Off the Press. It's another Bill Anderson song. And Bill Anderson's the fellow who wrote... Uh, Slipping Away, the one we just did, yes. And here's Bill Anderson's song, At the Time, to sing it for you. Here's Jean Shepard. I told him that I loved him Cause I loved him at the time told him that I didn't want any other lips touching mine. I whispered, love your kisses are sweeter than the wine. But I'd never tasted champagne at the time. At the time, Embrace if you've never had filet mignon, peanut butter taste just fine, and that's the way it was when I loved him at the time. When I found you, I started hearing 
pretty music I'd never heard. And quietly, when we spoke of love, it was like I'd learned a brand new word. I once thought I'd seen everything, but till I met you, I was blind. And I wonder, was I even born at the time? Salting crackers taste just fine And that's the way it was When I loved him at the time If you've never been to Paris, France Big Spring, Texas will suit you fine And that's the way it was When I loved him at the time That's a great new sound by Gene Shepard. Gene, I recall uh, on the Grand Ole Opry, the late Tex Ritter used to refer to you as the little gal from Oklahoma who went to California and then came to Nashville. Is that about the way it happened? Yes, we migrated to California right uh, a couple of years before World War II ended. And that's where I got started, was in California. Hank Thompson helped me to get my recording contract. And uh, it's been a great career for me, I'll put it that way, ever since. Well, now, back in, uh, in Oklahoma, were you too young at that time to have an interest yes. in music? Yes. Yes, uh, just in church, you know, the church choirs and things. And we had the Sunday uh, meetings, you know. Usually the, uh, the circuit preacher got around to us about once a month. <laughs> well, when you were singing in church, did, did it ever occur to you that you might have a career as a singer? Not really, Hal. All I knew is I just, I love country music. We'd listen to the Grand Ole Opry on an old battery radio. And uh, we'd save that battery. We wouldn't run it down. Mother would listen to a couple of the old soap opera like operas like Ma Perkins and <laughs> Stella yeah, Dallas. <laughs> yeah. We'd save that battery till Saturday night till the Grand Ole Opry come on. Uh, then you went to California. Did your family move there? Yes, uh, we mm -hmm. moved to California, and uh, I graduated from high school there. And when I was about a sophomore in high school, I became very interested in uh, you know for going ahead. I'll put it that way with my career. My choir teacher in high school in California, he. Uh, started coaxing me, you know, and uh, helping me a little bit. Gene, so many people who get interested in country music somehow, one way or the other, learned to play guitar first. Did you? Was that one of the first no, things? No, I you? learned to play the upright bass. You played upright? <laughs> the big bass fiddle, yes. And uh, I still play, can fiddle around with the bass, you know, play it a little bit, but uh, oh. I don't play much guitar. Well, then did you join a group? Uh, I had an all-girl band. I guess I probably had the first all-girl band that there was. And it was just a bunch of us girls that went to high school together. And it was called the Melody Ranch Girls. And at that time, I think Gene Autry had a place called the Melody Ranch. But we yeah. didn't, uh, we knew of Gene Autry, but we didn't know of Gene Autry's Melody Ranch. <laughs> How did you happen to meet Hank Thompson? He let me sing with his group one night. He come to this, uh, it was a big dance hall in California. And the man that managed our little all-girl band, he asked Hank if I could sing a song with him. And uh, so Hank said, well, sure. And uh, I got up and sang with Hank, and he helped me get my first recording contract, which was, was, was with Capitol Records. And uh, you had, of course, a great career with Capitol Records through the years, and you're on another label now. 21 You've years with Capitol. 21 years. Yes. Well, we want to hear another Gene S uh, Shepherd song right here, and I, if I'm not mistaken... Uh, this was a big pop hit at one time, yeah. but it was written mm -hmm. by a country songwriter and a good old country boy. I think that makes it country. A pretty song and a beautiful job the way Gene Shepherd sings, Are You Sincere? Are you sincere when you say Which way to go 
will our love grow? Are you sincere? Are you sincere? When you say that you miss me, are you sincere? Every time that you kiss me, and are you really mine? Every day. I'd like to know which way to go. Will our love grow? Are you sincere? Oh, it's good to hear that song again. When it's done the way Gene Shepherd does, it's always a treat. Gene will be back with a final song in just a moment. Well, I think it's obvious from uh, your choice of songs that uh, Bill Anderson's one of your favorite songwriters, Gene. <laughs> yes, he is. I have to be truthful, though. When uh, I did this song, I really didn't know that uh, Bill had written it. I had, I knew, but I had forgotten it. Charlie Leuven had a big song on it at one time, and this was the uh, what we call the B side of the Slipping Away, the record that did so well for us. And uh, but Bill did write it, and uh, happily so. Bill is, I'll put it this way, he's a great songwriter. Gene, you can be back with us next week. I certainly hope so. And here's Gene Shepherd's special way on a great song. Think I'll go somewhere and cry myself to sleep. I just kissed the one I love for the last time and never have his soft lips been so sweet He's gone With Gene Shepard as our special guest this has been Navy Hoedown, a public service presentation of this station and your United States Navy and Naval Reserve The United States Navy wishes to thank this station for its cooperation in bringing these weekly programs to you and for contributing valuable station time in doing so Watch for us next time around until then, this is Hal Durham reminding you, if you're going to be someone, why not be someone special? And he slowly ran his fingers down my cheek. I thought I'd die when he said he still loved me. Cry myself to sleep. I go.